So up next, we're going to be visiting the Stem Cell Technology Institute, where researchers are hard at work, diligently, actually, on the forefront of everything from tissue engineering, stem cell gene manipulation, and much, much more. With countless research projects underway, scientists at the Institute have helped make Iran a leader in stem cell research around the world. So please enjoy as we bring to you some of the fascinating work going on presently at the Stem Cell Technology Institute. Stem Cell Technology Institute first Iranian Provide Center on Tissue Engineering has been uh, established since 2004. So the main focus of the present time is on research projects, development of uh, clinical products for the uh, regeneration of damage or disease tissue is the long-term objective of this center. Tissue engineering as a multidisciplinary field integrated the concept of the life science uh, such uh, as uh, biology, chemistry and engineering uh, with uh, uh, surgical techniques and uh, require uh, close interaction between um, specialists uh, in different fields. To this end, top researcher in different fields including basic sciences medicine and engineering have been employed developing modern technology especially non-technology biotechnology and stem cell biology there have been attempts to improve in this field and quite independent of high-tech countries at this time uh, four research team including uh, biomaterial and non-technology uh, stem cell biology uh, molecular biology and surgery are uh, cooperating in this center for the uh, research uh, uh, projects. Our research programs in the molecular biology and genetic engineering department uh, is concentrated to three parts. Uh, a group of our uh, investigators are uh, studying about microRNA biogenesis uh, and its effect on stem cells' fate. The second group is the, the designing and constructing of tissue-specific vectors, uh, I mean viral vectors and non-viral vectors. Uh, and the last group is uh, going to gene manipulating of uh, stem cells uh, to differentiate the them uh, in differentiation state or like a neuron uh, or liver. Uh, at present, uh, more than uh, 50 postgraduate uh, students and uh, PhD students are investigating in this uh, department uh, to earn these goals. Biomaterials and uh, nanotechnology research group, uh, one of the main research groups of this institute has been established from the beginning. The main objective and tasks of this group uh, include various and worldwide research projects in system biology and biomaterials fields. Um, at the present time, experts of various engineering fields such as polymer engineering, chemical engineering, system and control engineering, electronic engineering, biomedical engineering, mechanical engineering, and textile engineering have close interaction and cooperation with other research groups in Stem Cell Institute. Now we focus on system biology and biomaterials. The main focus of biomaterial research team is designing and manufacturing special biomaterials for various medical applications. However, the main core of the team is designing and manufacturing two- and three-dimensional engineering scaffolds for various tissue engineering applications. To achieve this goal, the research group attempts to produce scaffolds with defined physical, chemical, biological, and morphological properties which is made by using various materials, equipments, processing methods, 
and high technologies, especially nanotechnology. The most important research topics of stem cells and tissue engineering department are as follows. 1. A study of biology of stem cell types, including embryonic stem cells, mesenchymal stem cells, unrestricted somatic stem cells, hematopoietic stem cells, and tissue-specific stem cells from various biological sources such as umbilical cord blood, bone marrow, and different tissues of human nose and rat. 2. Bone tissue engineering aiming at applications in repair of bone injuries and skin tissue engineering in bones and cosmetic uses. Liver tissue engineering using concurrent use of stem cells and appropriate nano scaffolds. The results of this work published in European and American journals.